Hey, this is Larissa Lost back again, and today I'm unboxing Homura Devil Self. Now, this is an Android number 456 456. And it's the devil version. I've already removed the sticker, and I got this as a gift from my boyfriend, and I love him very much, and he's great. To match my Godo car. So let's start unboxing her. As I said, I already removed the sticker. Alright, that's her out of the box. So let's get onto the packaging first. You've got all these images and then you've got a little view window with De Devil Homura written on it and then you've got a bunch of different poses on the back and more poses and a viewing window now what's great on this box is there is these little feathers you can see it there that are on the box and they're really quite beautiful and I like them see now, uh, in the viewing window, they've got these um, images of her soul gem printed onto the plastic in purple. And even the inside of the box is coloured, which is a really cool thing. And I like it. Right. Now, instructions. Okay. Now... I thought this was going to be some regular instructions, right? But I opened it, and to my surprise, I was reading English. English, people! English! Which is absolutely great. <laughs> now, what you all actually came here for, the figure. wrapped in packaging. You've got her standard stand and the neck joint. And then she's all wrapped up in plastic. So peel her away. Slight pansu shot there. Oh she's beautiful. Look at her guys. Isn't she gorgeous? Alright, let's move that plastic away. And that Oh, her bow. There we are. And you've got to remove the bow to get the plastic off her head. And her fringe as well, which I didn't see at first. There's plastic here inside her fringe piece. Or bangs, as they could be called by like Americans, but I'm English, so you know. Now, she comes with her bow, which I'm just putting back now, and she's adorable. She really, really is. She is absolutely adorable. Oh, she's beautiful. She excites me no end. But yeah, that's Humra. Isn't she so cute? Oh. Now, what else did she come with? She comes with two face plates. Some sort of smile. She looks like she's smiling anyway. Ooh, she's gorgeous. Then, you've got a bunch of different arms. One, two, three, four. Four arms, as well as this one arm which is pinching cube, which is really incredible and I love because, you know, Cubay's an arse even though I've got a plushie of him and, yeah. and the soul gem is absolutely tiny I'm afraid to take it out of the box so, yeah and what you've all been waiting for 
are actually articulated and they've got this sort of clearness to them they go from black to a kind of purple colour and they're just really beautiful bent that one <laughs> now oh yeah we also have a uh, sitting down leg piece as well which was in this box a uh, box in this plastic wrap and yeah she's just sat down and it's really cute so I'm going to do a pose with her and you guys can watch that but only one because yeah time oh they've learned instead of like Madoka putting it at the back they've now put it at the front and her look at the sculpt of her dress it's gorgeous now I would pause it but I can't actually pause it so that sort of sucks but that's her wing in really easy to do you do have to give it a little bit of force but not so much that you worry about breaking the figure there oh isn't she gorgeous look at her Stand up and running. Ooh. Mm. Let's figure out this. Aha, uh -huh. she's got one in her back. Dropping parts now. Oh, and I've got my hair stuck to the tape. And that's the wrong little thingy, Majik. Yup. A. Hey. Nope. Okay, this is getting a bit long now, so I'm just gonna leave it there. With isn't she beautiful? And I'll continue to play with her. Bye guys. <laughs>